Yo, you stupid, bro. So we out here, you know, we in Seattle right now, chilling with uh, my bro in laws. Uh, but I, I have a unique set of uh, brother in laws, man, talented, uh, beyond me, uh, and beyond what words can actually describe. Fortunately enough, he's here to describe uh, what I mean and to tell you guys uh, who he is, man. Uh, we're dealing with my my brother-in-law, William Winfield. Uh, the vision behind uh, We Are Royalty, man. He is right here. What's up, Will? What's going on? What's going on, kings and queens? It's your boy, Will. Blessed in the building. Out here in beautiful, beautiful Seattle. Um, listen, man, when people ask me, you know what I'm saying, they see the logo, you know what I'm saying, they're like, what's that represent, you know, and I tell them off rip, you know, um, my mission is to add value to the earth, my mission is to make sure I let people know their purpose, and, you know, the slogan, turning broken people into masterpieces, like, it's not just a slogan, man, it's a lifestyle, you feel me, like, I was homeless, my mom was a high school dropout, my dad was a high school dropout, you know what I'm saying, my grandmother passed away, I've been in, you know, been betrayed, been in bad relationships, been in bad friendships, right? I used to go to the club, drink, smoke, all that crazy stuff, right? And I had to realize, yo, like, life is more than just doing what other people are doing, right? And what, you know, 95% of the world is average. You feel me? Like, average. And I had to understand that, yo, I'm royalty. Like, I don't have to do what the world is doing. I don't have to do what other people are doing. And once I found who I was and what I was called to do, it changed the whole trajectory of my life. Not just my life, but my kids' life. You feel me? My sons, my daughters, my wife's, my mom's, right? And, you know, I'm, I'm walking on planes. I'm like, yo, how come I got to continue to go to coach, right? How come I can't be in first class? You feel me? Like, how come I can't write a book? You feel me? And from somebody who was in special ed, um, from kindergarten all the way to ninth grade in high school, I wrote three books. I'm on my fourth book. So it's just like, I don't do it to boast. I don't do it to brag. I do it to let you guys know. I don't care what you've been through, what you're going through. You can make it. You can make your dreams a reality. But you just have to remember, right? The greatest enemy of progress is your last success. Don't get comfortable with what you did. I need you to start getting ready to get, get ready to do what you need to do. It's your boy Willis Bless. Love y'all. Peace.